bundle up nice and warm. It's going to get cold this week. Hey gang, I'm your host Brian Rollins and this is episode 207 of the Dorky, Geeky, Nerdy Trivia Podcast. This week we've got Minnesota trivia as our topic. If you're new, welcome aboard. Every week we've got 30 trivia questions on a different topic. This season we're covering all 50 states. We're almost done, so if you're looking for a particular state, check past episodes at dorkygeekynerdy.com. The site has a search feature that helps you find whatever you're looking for. That covers the essentials, so let's get started. The Dorky Round Number 1. What two states border Minnesota to the west? North and South Dakota. Number two, born in Minnesota in 1971, what actress starred in movies like Beetlejuice, Little Women, Heathers, and most recently, Stranger Things? Winona Ryder. Number 3. Born Frances Ethel Gum, what actress and singer became an icon with her 1939 portrayal of Dorothy Gale? Judy Garland Number 4. Performing under his first name, What musician had hits with Purple Rain, When Doves Cry, and Little Red Corvette? Prince Number 5. Located in Minnesota, what is the largest shopping center in the U.S.? The Mall of America. Number 6. Born in Austin, Minnesota, what NFL coach would go on to win 16 sports Emmys as an announcer, as well as lend his name to one of the longest-running video game franchises around? John Madden. Number seven. What Minnesotan would publish The Great Gatsby in 1925? F. Scott Fitzgerald. Number eight. What artist, born in Minnesota, created The Peanuts? In 1950. Charles Schulz. Number 9. What 1970s TV series, named for its star, would create three spin offs Rhoda, Phyllis, and Lou Grant? The Mary Tyler Moore Show. Number 10. What NFL team calls Minnesota home? The Minnesota Vikings. The Geeky Round. Number 1. What singer-songwriter from Duluth had hits with Like a Rolling Stone and Visions of Joanna. Bob Dylan Number 2. 
What is the capital of Minnesota? St. Paul. Number three. What 2007 comedy drama starred Elliot Page as a pregnant teenager in Elk River, Minnesota? Juno. Number four. By population, what is the largest city in Minnesota? Minneapolis. Number five. What brothers from St. Louis Park, Minnesota, brought us films like Raising Arizona, Fargo, and Oh Brother, Where Art Thou? The Coen Brothers. Number six. Born in Rochester, Minnesota, what actress starred in all three Back to the Future movies, as well as the first Marvel movie, Howard the Duck? <laughs> Leah Thompson. Number seven. What book series and TV show was set in Walnut Grove, Minnesota? Little House on the Prairie. Number eight. What actor, director, and artist was born in Minnesota, but moved to England and became a member of the Monty Python troupe? Terry Gilliam. Number nine. What state borders Minnesota to the south? <laughs> Iowa. Number ten. What Minnesota actor had roles in films like Wedding Crashers, Jurassic Park, Lost World? In dodgeball, Vince Vaughn. The nerdy round. Number one, hailing from New Ulm, Minnesota, what actress made her mark with The Birds in 1963 and Marnie in 1964? Tippy Hedren. Number two. What 1992 Disney movie would go on to inspire the name of a real-life hockey team in 1993? The Mighty Ducks. Number three. What U.S. senator from Minnesota ran for president in 2020 and was the first speaker at President Biden's inauguration in 2021? Amy Klobuchar. Number four. Minnesota touches which of the five Great Lakes? Lake Superior. Number five, set in Wabasha, what 1993 movie starred comedy legends Jack Lemmon and Walter Matthau?
Grumpy old men. Number six. Minnesota borders what two Canadian provinces? Ontario and Manitoba. Number seven. What professional wrestler became mayor of Brooklyn Park, then governor of Minnesota in 1999? Jesse Ventura. Number eight. Set in Devil's Kettle, Minnesota. What 2009 horror comedy starred Megan Fox and Amanda Seyfried? <laughs> Jennifer's Body. Number nine. What politician served as vice president to Jimmy Carter and would later win the Democratic nomination for president? In 1984, Walter Mondale. Number ten. According to its nickname, Minnesota is home to how many lakes? It's the land of ten thousand lakes. Officially, there are eleven thousand four hundred eighty-two lakes in the state. And that's it for our Minnesota trivia questions. Want some bonus facts? Minnesota became a state in 1858, making it the 32nd state in the union. It ranks 22nd in population and 12th in land mass. It's home to the largest population of Somali Americans in the U.S. The governor and both senators are members of the Democratic Farmer Labor Party, an affiliate of the U.S. Democratic Party. It was formed in 1944 when the Minnesota Democratic Party merged with the Farmer Labor Party. It's a relatively flat state, with its highest point, Eagle Mountain. Only reaching 2,300 feet, about 700 meters. Minnesota is not one of the states I visited yet. I'll leave it up to you, Minnesotans, to tell me where I need to go if I ever make it up there. This is the first episode I've written and recorded in 2023, so I have all my stats for last year. 2022 was a big year for the show. We had over eighty thousand downloads for the year. That's half our total downloads for all of the show's history. So a big thank you for all your support this year. This season is winding down, and I'm excited for season five next month. I'm still a little weirded out that I'm coming up on a fifth season for the show. I'll be back here next week with another U.S. state. Here's a clue. What state is home to the oldest state capital? Good luck, and I'll see you back here next Wednesday. This has been episode 207 of the Dorky Geeky Nerdy Trivia Podcast. The music has been provided by Jason Shaw at Audionautics.com. This show was written, produced, and hosted by me, Brian Rollins. You can find me at thevoicesinmyhead.com. Thanks for listening.